Hey folks, Quilly Teen here to welcome to another episode of Let's Play RimWorld Awesome Androids Edition. Where we are, I mean, despite having taken some hits, we're doing pretty well. We're a little lower on androids than we used to be. Although, we can fix that. If ever we get some Plasteel, we can get some Resurrection Kits working again. We do, in theory, have maybe some Plasteel mining that's going to happen there. Maybe some Uranium mining that's going to happen there. Mostly, we're just waiting patiently. There's just, I think, a lot of outstanding little... Uh, uh, mining jobs otherwise. I mean, clearing this area out is not bad either. Um, there's some overhead mountain, although mostly it's some thin roof, so I think we won't... I left this in here as a support. I think we're going to be okay without having any collapse over here. But yeah, I think the priority on the deep drills is lower than regular mining. I did go and draw out a couple more little exploratory paths over here, still hoping to maybe find some uranium in them dar hills. We'll see. But I'm not holding my breath. Suppose if we get attacked by mechanoids, we'd get some plasteel. Don't usually, like, um, you know, request mechanoids to attack us, but it might not be the worst. Yeah, if I remove this, we're going to be okay. Oops. Uh, L to mine. Not X to deconstruct. Gonna haul that away. And I guess I can, just for completeness sake, we'll go ahead and concrete that up as well. You know, because we need more, like, useless time-filling jobs, which is what's going on here. Colonists need treatment. That's just for anxiety, I think. Hey! Level up in plants. Nice. And some more heal root. Caravan is back. Yeah, we had the little peace talk, or, well, negotiation between two other factions. That we, uh, we interfered with a little to get a, a boost with one of the factions. Um... It's been a long time since we've had anyone visit us with the hospitality mod. We've seen that before, where all of a sudden the hospitality mod feels like it stops working. I don't know if there's a way to force a reset of it. Um, there you go. I don't know why it's not always alphabetical. Reset that, I don't know. Turn the main bar. Is it a guest tab? Oh, down there. I mean, we don't have any. Oh, the inverting of a zone is kind of handy. Yeah, so this is just managing areas, generally speaking. Not managing areas for guests. We're just not getting any. I also feel like we're getting a lot of, uh, ooh, persuasion. Social impact. Hey, I'll tell you what, um, Abby. I'm going to get you to force wearing of those. Because you do most of our talkie talk, and that'll help you do the talkie talkie. Maybe there's just too many people in here. Maybe there's a limit. Like, the hospitality doesn't work when you get to a certain number. I don't think that's the case, though. It just seems to sort of maybe stop sometime in the saves. We didn't get the, uh, the reveal message, but technically I can spot that there now. That's nice. I mean, so, at least component mining, we've got a little bit more of that. Still would like some Plasteel. Uh, although, I guess there's, um... There was the Plasteel mine, but over here somewhere? But I think people may have gotten to it already? No, it was over here. You know what? Yeah, hold on a sec. I forgot we did have that section. Abby... Come over here. I'm gonna force you mining this. I know, it's gonna kinda suck. Do, do, do. So, I guess I could set up some individual clothing rules, maybe for uh, bulk goods trader. Hello. Um, I'm going to let you finish that chunk first, Abby. Thanks. Um, individual clothing rule for people with slightly different uh, work roles. 
to equip things like the uh, overalls and the chef's hat and things like that, but rather than doing it fully manually, but I don't know, it's kind of okay. Speaking of the cooking, so Morty's the only person with any pa I guess the chef's hat, maybe I don't want to build chef's hats. I just realized, because chef's hats would mean no helmet, which sounds no good. Your components got steel. No plasteel, though, right? Boo! Got lots of money? Well, you don't have infinite money, unfortunately. But, and we did burn through a fair amount of steel more recently. That's, that's interesting. Why is it reporting that as the mod for steel? Uh, but we will go ahead and... Oh, you don't actually have components for sale. Oh, shit, this is pretty crummy. I mean, at least we'll make some money, I guess. Let me buy cloth, which we don't have any. Actually, it might not be a terrible idea to buy some. Uh, clothing. Yeah, turn that off. Because we want helmets on heads. Uh, so Abby, I was going to say, you pro you needed some recreation, which you're taking care of now. Okay, now, come here and force doing this. More plasteel. Still need uranium. Which we can get from here, but it's such a long, slow job. I don't know what else we were waiting for plasteel for. I know I put down some things that needed... I think mostly we've queued things that need plasteel more than anything else. Like armored vests. Maybe I should turn that off. You know what? I will. Um, I'm going to suspend this and that. Don't use plasteel for this until we need it. Eh? Oh. Um, because... Oh, quite a lot of it. Oh, that's the plasteel there. Oh, interesting. Are you still on a force job? Yeah, let me reset you there so you're not forced to do this anymore. We don't need to rush those components. We really need a bulk goods trader spaceship. Okay, maybe, maybe it's time we do consider going out in the world and doing some trade. So... Show that what they'll buy. Oh, they're hostile. Ooh. Okay, that's less than great. You know, I'm gonna check out the hot the expo. Once this destroyed, blueprint implants. Oh, you're just panicking. Hmm. Wow, power situation. And I could turn off the guns. I don't. It's not a good setup right now for a switch. Although maybe I could install some switch banks and then build around that because this is pretty rough. Or just expand more power. Like a big grid of solar panels might be a good idea. I mean, now that I have bridges, what I could do... As long as I don't leave a gap, people aren't going to use it for cover and then get it to be shot. But yeah, let's build a bunch of solar panels over here. Yeah, I like that. Thunderstorm. Zap. Doesn't this have a heavy overhead mountain right here? Oh no, it's got a little hole. Huh. A little hole so the lightning can come through. So yeah, it's going to have to build a bunch of bridges, but I guess that's fine. Which will put out some more wood chopping commands. Might not be the most efficient place, but... It's a decent place in terms of, like, it doesn't really get in the way. There we go. And you're connected to the grid. Indeed you are. Okay, good. Use a piece. Okay, that's fine. A little fire over there. Not a huge deal. Wasn't anything else in here? No, I guess we mined that out. This is what? Limestone. 
I still kind of expect there's probably green. And by the way, I've recorded the last, uh, I think this is my fourth episode in a row. Um, so if someone did respond to my quest for uranium last video or the one before that with uh, pointing out where some might be, I just have not seen that yet. Do -do -do. Part of me is wondering if I could have been more judicious with my plasteel usage earlier on. Silver, silver. What was this one? Uranium over there. Plasteel over here. So yeah, we're going to want to mine all those, but yeah. There's no point in putting down more of these deep miners right now, because mostly it's just a question of labor. They're not building the flooring in a very good order. Hang on, did it cancel... I think it canceled the solar generator jobs over here. That's weird. Oh, look! It, hit, it just did it again! Is it out of wood so it decides to air out? I don't know. We'll leave just the bridge jobs in there. We are kind of out of wood. Uh, forestry gets done every day. That's good. Forging every five days. I guess that's fine, too. Uh, forging. This is for, I think, just food crops. Just turn up. Compact and machinery. Oh, right there! Wow, there's a lot of compact and machinery on this map. Which, I mean, is good. If we were out of components, we'd be very upset. So I guess it's nice that we've got that. It's not what we're looking for right now, but we're only not looking for it because we have such an excess. Growing arm is done. Yeah, so we're not going to grow anything else in this vat. Um, honest, I'll also deconstruct it. We're going to get some of the material back, because I think some plasteel went into this. I don't remember. It's clearly not something we terribly need. Maybe we're going to be cloning vats later on. You have anxiety, right? No. Oh, it's your organ rejection. Oh, it is going down, because it was at, like, medium, so now it's mild. So it is getting better and presumably will be fully integrated into Morty's body soon enough. Okay, we need more uh, sci-fi wall lights. Like an excessive amount of lighting here, but that's okay. It looks cool. So having some light, at first of all, mostly makes things look better. Um, but they do walk a little faster in little lighted areas, so. Level 5 in mining. Although you're way over here, you're harvesting trees, right? Which we do need, because we need more wood for this. Harvesting some potatoes. Alright, we... We, have, we are back to a decent amount of harvested stuff. We have, like, way more hay than we really need. We're mostly letting these guys graze, which is okay. News of peace. More people making friends. Okay. And if everyone makes friends with each other, where does that leave us? Let me get rid of that, because it looks stupid. We don't need to, but it's bothering me. Therefore, I must get rid of it. with metallic wool. All right, I'm not too worried about that rotting out, so I don't need to put anything urgent on it. Hmm. There we go, more solar power. And it's more things to maintain. Although at least that doesn't eat up more components. All it does is use up more time. I don't know what's more valuable, the time or the components, but from a realism point of view, I really like this, like constant maintenance instead of random breakdowns. Do, do, do. The weird cancelling is still, well, weird to me. Oh, uh, this needs to be set as a mayoral office. Excellent. No statues waiting. Oh no, I got one here. It's just normal, but you know what? That's fine. We might put a bunch of statues in there. Morty making some dusters. Where are you going? Oh, the metallic wool. Manhunter pack. Manhunting pigs. That actually sounds terrifying. Okay, there's not a ton of them, which is good. 
Come in here. Actually, I guess I'll recruit Robert. Throw you in here. And just for simplicity, I should maybe just keep Robert, like, recruited all the time. So the pigs should come around this way. Where are they going? Oh, you were instructed to stand where the trap is. I was like, why are you so stupid to hit the trap? Because of me. Do these... Okay. Should be fine. And then it's gonna be bacon for us. And done. And unforbid everything. Alright. Afton, how badly were you hurt? Ah, you're fine. Just a few cracks. Okay, good. Because our traps can do a lot of damage. So. Middle finger shattered. It's on a robot. As I say, if we have any squishy, squishy humanoids, then... Like this. It's just a bite scar. We've got more body parts to replace. Um, conquest. Lost a place. Ooh, they flipped a location on their map. Okay. Good for them, I guess. I don't know. We, de we pull that apart. A five-hole plasteel bank. woo -hoo. Do this. Part of me is wondering if that's properly reachable or not. I'm going to go ahead and... Is the bridge under here? No, it is breach reachable, but I'm going to go ahead and do that. It'll feel better. Oh, wait, they don't have to slop through the water to do maintenance and various things like that later on either. I mean, I know they can walk through these things, but this will just keep things a little faster. And that feels good. Munch in some grass. is sowing an area. We do have a lot of crops. We do need a fair number. Hey, there we go. Resistance broken. No body parts. Any beautiful, cool-headed. Oh, yeah, the adrenaline stuff. It'd be nice if that was like a reduced, like, or an improved break threshold thing, but I guess we'll take what we can get. Part of me wonders if I should just crank the mining up. I mean, there's some outstanding mining on the map. Mostly the, um, it's to make sure someone's always working at the mining drills. This is what I'm most eager about. So I'm going to find Neil. There you go, you're full. Maintaining the ground penetrating scanner. I'm going to get you to come over here and force you to work at the uranium mine. So first chunk of uranium is coming up now. Okay, infusion, hooray. So yeah, only nine. And what is this? And kibble? Wait. What? Were you carrying kibble? Why is there kibble on the ground? And yeah, this is so slow. I think that's the reason it's deprioritized compared to overland mining, because the overland mining just gives you so much more material, so much more consistently. Okay, we do have negative power at night, which is not really a surprise, but our batteries are fully charged now. Go. We need 35 to be able to start our uranium or our nuclear training. I'm sure we're gonna need tons more uranium after that, so maybe rushing this is a little silly, but I don't care. How you doing? If I clear prioritize work, force work was done. You're gonna go and maintain instead as a priority, and because you've got construction set higher. You know what? Actually, I will lower your construction below mining. Yeah. And you will cook before mine. Although the cooking stations are used a little bit more frequently. There's competition for the cooking stations, therefore... More compact machinery. Jeez! Okay, really no shortage of that. 
And be really nice to strike Plasteel or Uranium. Feeding fine meal to Nettie. Yeah, I guess someone's got to. Builder's Jacket. Yeah, so who's our cheap constructor? It's Sam. Uh, did someone grab the Builder's Jacket already? Maybe. I don't know. Alright, it's fine. Whatever. Poor Took is infused. Well, it's not quite as impressive sounding. Oh, new recruit! Nettie, welcome to the party! Um... Yeah, with a few more of these new people, what it'll do, we'll put them on an inverted schedule. There's no penalty of having a normal person, like, sleep during the day and work at night. Other than, I mean, they don't like it if they're in the dark, but otherwise they don't really care. And that just means you can, you know, make more use of your, your stations. Okay, I'll do that. Basic. Yeah, quarry, stone quarries. Oh, we're going to leave that off grow into mine is kind of that. Actually, you've got such a high passion for plant cut. Yeah. If there's any chopping to be done, I guess we'll use the people with passion for it. Um, I'll enable these as sort of a, just a bit of a generic filler if you've literally got nothing else going on. And yeah, I'll leave the mining on because we kind of need that. You've got growing? Oh yeah. So you might get a little bit of mining done. Plain horseshoes. Uh, robotic components. So, I think... I don't remember how many of these we need to keep around. I feel like we need, like, maybe groups of eight or something to do things. I'm going to do until X, where... X might be ten at first. Sure. And then we'll see. And actually, we are nearly done researching the cleaning bot. Which is pretty amazing, actually. So yeah, if we can get some components started, I should do the thing where we just um, let them just drop it. Uh, oh, details, that's what I want. Boom. And just do something like that. Level 5 mining. Okay, that's fine. More components over here. Abby, I'll wake you up right now. Yeah, get your meal, and then I'll probably force you to do a bit more of this. Poor Abby. Digging at limestone? No, you're going to dig over here instead. So none of it run brought over, because it just gets stockpiled, but in theory, we're very close to the uranium amount. I don't know where the uranium is in here. Presumably it should be in here, I just don't know what it looks like. Yeah, if we're using wireless power, the supernova disturbance would be kind of annoying. Morty levels up in crafting. He's mostly just doing research right now. Maybe he had a conversation go on. Are you, like, starting a bunch of different outfits and then not finishing them? Ryan? I got my eye on you. Okay, there we go. Alright, now you're wrapping some stuff up. Okay. There we go. All the uranium's in place. All right, I'm going to uh, I'm going to stop the force job on there. I'm going to build this. So it doesn't you know it's still a reactor. I wonder if it still might generate some power. Also, I noticed in the uh, rim atomics there's like pipes. Do we need to get like water pipes in here? I mean that's how it would work. Research speed factor plus ten percent inactive. Step completed. Okay, so someone's got to do more research to complete this, maybe at this spot. There you go, Morty's working at the root nuclear reactor. Um, there's no air vents here. Uh, climate, rather. Oh. Yeah, let's do that. And five, oh, multiple people can work on it at the same time. That's interesting.
And then it's doing this? Yeah. Is it advancing this research? No, I don't think so. No, I mean, it shouldn't. There's supposed to be different things. Are you... No, we have huge amounts of excess power, but this is requiring power. Why are we sending it so much? I guess the uh, the solar generators do make a lot of power. Obviously only during part of the, the day, but yeah, and there it is. That's ticking along nicely. Okay. These little bits of flooring look kind of stupid, but they do take a lot of time to, like, remove, so... I don't know, it might still be worth doing at some point. I mean, I did the wall, so why not, right? There's some steel over there. I mean, still no shortage of steel in the map. Hey, we got dinosaurs! Still have these wildebeests, which apparently were like 20% chance to go and assault you. And a raid! Pirates attacking immediately. I have some weapons, they don't look terribly scary. Um, well, actually, I'll do everyone, including Robert, because I'm worried that Robert will wander somewhere bad. So we'll get everyone over here in the defensive area. Go, go, go. Honestly, there's so few of the pirates, we probably could just assault them anywhere. I'd be a little annoyed if they decide to smash the door instead of coming into our kill zone. No, here they go. And actually, we might have to be ready to chase them sooner rather than later if they all die from traps. Yeah, because now these guys know about the traps. Yeah, he's off the screen. Uh, and they're dead. Okay. Unforbid everything. Autopsy is... This is probably still just the be butcher one. No! Proper autopsy. We have someone with the skill again. Here, I can suspend that job then. Well, no, I guess I'll leave it in here. Because it's still going to prioritize the top one. Yeah, that actually works out fairly well. Sometimes, because of weird timing and people being busy... Someone might just do the bottom one instead of the top one, but it's hardly the end of the world. We have plenty of body parts now. Now, since we're Android-based, we really don't need this many body parts. <laughs> okay, more advanced research is now available. Ah, nuclear power. Power plant, scalable design, the ability to run multiple reactors, turbines, generators, and cooling solution in a single system. Each reactor is capable of producing more than 200 kilowatts when fully fueled. Yeah, kilowatts. Wow. So 200,000 watts when fully fueled, and I guess with everything attached. And yeah, all these little pipes and things like that. Um, reactors can also be used for plutonium production. What the hell are we going to do with that? And the energy weapons. I wonder if we need plutonium to make these weapons. Tesla coils? Here, let's start this project. Cleaner bot is done. So, yeah, being able to build one of those. Tier 1, 2, th okay. So, how do I make robotic matrices? So I can't make them here. Oh. Okay. Basic robot. So this unlocks the type, but I do need these. And then... We might want to queue up the next tier as well. Okay, so I can't even get a basic cleaning bot unless I can do a simple robotic matrix, which right now I can't. So yeah, it's all these extra levels of stuff. I'll probably build one the second I can. Boomlope is pregnant. Morty's of level 14. Intellect. Good for him, Morty. Good for you, Morty. Change your clothes and eat some food and feel better about yourself. Um, do we still have? Yeah, we have only one unknown bedroom. But that's it. We might redo these guest rooms as proper bedrooms since you know no one's interested in anything. Oh, yeah, it's probably the same compact as steel. 
Robert levels up. Morty is feeling super creative. Legendary stuff. Alright, well, I don't know. You can probably just keep researching. You actually have a lot of research to do. Um, ba -ba -ba -bum. Tyler's getting some cleaning done. So you got, Tyler, you got all the way down to your cleaning duty, which is set to a two. Okay. I guess you were probably doing a lot of cooking, which is why you were never getting around to cleaning. Holy crap, we have a lot of meals made. Nice. Fly researching over here. Yes, without a steady supply of uranium, I'm worried that like nuclear power is not really an option for us. So much underground mining we can do. Uh, is this a A tier resurrector kit? It is. So. Open this. I don't know. Crafting? Are you. Oh, you're visiting the grave! Assumed you were opening it. The talent's got high crap. I actually don't know what's needed for this. Use. Resurrect. No! So paste. can't do it. Are you tier 3? Tier 2. Why does it keep being interrupted? There you go. Using. Repairing. Bam! Flint's back, baby! I don't know if he was even that important, but... Oh, he's the neutered guy. Right. Time industrious, great memory, cyclically deaf, quick reflexes. Uh-huh. And does it remind remember your old work? I feel like it does. Or maybe not. Nice to have another medic around. Doctor Eight, that's someone who can butcher stuff. Handle this. May as well keep the, um actually at this point we can probably turn off that grow. Mine, plant cut, hall clean. Yeah. I like that. I don't put... Yeah, just level 4 crafting on everyone that can, like, at least cut a rock or something like that. But you will probably do a bunch of mining. Yep, digging a compact of machinery. Don't mind that. Struck compact steel. Wait, what is this? A silver ore. Hello. I missed that message. And actually, that is compacted steel we didn't know about, unless it wraps all the way down here. Huh. All those, because otherwise it's going to impede our movement here. Ditto. Is it O to haul? No, O is haul urgently. P to haul. Okay. Flint's got a major break risk already. <laughs> Damn it, Flint! We didn't bring you back to life so you can be a big whiner. Um, I think that little bit of flooring there is not going to get made. At least at this time. Although, you know what? I think I will go and do the thing. Uh, there you go. And then, yeah, the floor under there. Oh, also, we're missing that spot right there. And I think that spot over there. I'm sure a bunch of people have been getting kind of annoyed by some of these missing flooring spots. Uh, it is Fi's birthday. Ah, who is now menopausal. Dang. Well, we do potentially have a rejuvenation stuff we could try. Uh, cure anxiety, three glitter world. We need high level medicine stuff. I think the rejuvenation also needs glitter world medicine and probably a high skill. Tenth of the current biological age. So she just turned 47. So, I mean, about five years off. That's not that much. Not until we can get a steady supply of Glitter World. Plus, I suspect we just don't have the skill in the first place. Uh, social fight. Flint, goddammit. 
Don't make me put you back in the grave. I brought you back to this world. I can take you out of it. Trust me, I've killed plenty enough people in RimWorld to know that I can. And a boomob has a flu. I'm hoping you can get treatment. Um, I don't know if we have this, so let's make sure we've got animal sleeping spots. So that they, because they need to do that to actually get treatments. They need to be in a sleep spot somewhere. There we go. Now someone will look after them. Flint has no weapon. Is this a movement speed boost? Oh, recharge. It says a disc uh, uh, improvement to its research. reload speed. That's quite nice. Break risks. Tyler. Neutered. I harvested organs. We harvested organs. Oh, you're kind. I was gonna say no one's been, no one's been bothered by harvesting organs, right? You're even a robot. Who cares, right? But it's probably the kindness that's doing it. Mmm. Okay. So there's still tons of mining all over the place, which is still fairly legit, I think, to pursue. Oh, yeah, that was steel. Random little bits of silver. First Devil Strand Harvest. Still a little whiles away. I'm gonna do... Uh, we'll expand. Just like this. We'll have to do it again when it comes through. That's okay. Ryan level 16 crafting. Very nice. Making fancy pants. Hmm. What's this? Oh, that's our surgical mask. Yeah, maybe. Tyler's not antisocial on the basis of being neutered. Dude, I can't blame you, man. Like, I'm really sorry. I think I would like to play with this set of mods again, except without the androids. And maybe, I don't know, I'll add a few things. You know what we do? I would add the bad hygiene mod, uh, which I've only uh, played with finally because of a multiplayer with a Kiss for Luck and Briarstone and another social fight. A Kiss for Luck um, had uh, the bad hygiene mod. I was like, okay, this is actually quite a lot of fun. So, I can see us doing something a little bit more like that. Pirate Merchant. Slave Crispin is an uncle of Fi and grand uncle of Abdil. It feels like we should go and buy Crispin. Even though they may or may not be someone we actually want. Um, we also sell medicine at a good cost. Okay, Crispin, he's 62, which I guess makes sense that he's got, you know, some age. Congenital heart defect. Abrasive. Nice medical skill. I'll give you that, but dude, you're not really convincing me of things here. I think we might just buy a bunch of medicine. And call it that. Um, you know, we have tons of med. We make medicine now. Maybe we don't need that. Maybe we would... No, we can't quite afford. Still want to save for... Um, yeah. Ideally, buying a ton of plasteel in bulk here. Mm -hmm. So, what's our next step on the oh, weapon research bench? Yeah, I probably shouldn't have built this like this. Why are all this the buildings for this huge? Rimatonics is kind of annoying. Um, maybe what I'll do is I'll merge this building together. Kind of like that idea. Ah. Stupid consuming my inputs. A heat wave. Alright, well, most of our place is temperature controlled. So it should be okay. Well, speaking of, with this big room and me removing that off that wall, what I'll end up doing is putting some vents in here after all. And actually, speaking of, what's our capacity over here? Yeah, we do need a little bit more increase. Inspired surgery by five. Okay. Get rid of that 
air vent, although... There you go, like that. It's not air vent, but air pipe. Okay, and now flooring. Like that. There we go. So the big nuclear research center. Um, does it not actually have a work spot? Maybe it's like this building. Um, people can sort of access it from any side. Seems to be the way it works, maybe. They just go up and become adjacent to it, and then they're they're all set. Need plasteel? No. Okay, good. Steel and components, that's all. So yeah, I'm wondering if we need plutonium to get this to work, so we'll still need more stuff, but... I don't know, we'll just proceed for now. Leaving, dangerous temperature. Yeah, there's a heat wave. Um, I don't remember if there's a... Oh yeah, if I click this... 45... Oh, there you go. That's a quick and easy way to see where the temps are really double plus ungood. Um, there we go. I mean, it's not critical, but yeah, we'll vent into that room. Because why not? Okay, but yeah, over here. Couple more of those. And some more of those. Oh. There you go. And Okay. Done and done. And yeah, I know these like were facing each other. So there's like inconsistent facing with some of my air climate control buildings, but that's alright. Okay. Oh, temperature overlay button is very handy. But being able to see the temperature all the time is kind of not a big deal, but the overlay aspect is nice. Step completed. Yes, we have built that. Now we have to experiment with weapons. Morty is in his lab coat. Being a real Rick here. Ah, look at this! The laser beams! Oh, being all... Uh, blinding flash of light emanates from the facility. Also heard a bit of a reactive, like, sound here. Morty, have you been irradiated? Flash blindness. Okay. <laughs> uh, Colonist Idol. Roz. You really have nothing going on, Roz. Can't craft? There's nothing to mine? Really? Oh, wow. Okay. I guess all the overland mining jobs are done. Well, tell you what, let's go and set that one up and set that up. Uranium and Plasteel, we'll get a little bit more. I and mean, they'll have to be constructed first. Tyler back to cleaning. I'm surprised how we've like tackled a lot of this outstanding stuff. I assume we have still tons of steel and we do. I'm not sure people get flashed again here. And we've got to construct some more things after this. I wonder if you should go to actual full nuclear power next. Well, maybe we'll research that next. And then we'll see. In theory, we might get a steady trickle of uranium in here now. Why is that forbidden? We'll just do an unforbid everything, just in case. No, only one thing. And let's get some lights in here. Completed. Construct a semi-automated command station. Uh-huh. And then robotics. So we can make the simple one now. Now, I don't know if the next one, like if we want to make a tier two, the basic one, um, I don't know if it needs a simple first. We're researching it, I believe. Yeah, that's 10,000. Maybe I will just go and make one and we'll get started with a cleaner bot anyway. Okay. 
None of this needs Plasteel yet, which is interesting. The Cleaner Bot Tier 3 itself needs Plasteel. The question is whether the Robotic ma Matrices need it. But yeah, we'll make a Tier 1 Cleaner Bot. And then maybe we'll hold off. After we've got this, we'll swing back over to a, um, a Kitchen Bot. so much to do. Yeah, the level 5. And the anti-logic bots. Omnibots. They just do everything. Super rocks are capable of almost any task. They're just like a Kellanist, basically. Ambobonics, Battle Boosters, Neuroscience. Oh, Joywire. What does that sound? News a piece. Oh, okay. Oh. Neutromine synthesis, if we want more neutromine. Nerve stapling. Torture! Ooh, how fun. That's exactly what I like to see in my game. Mmm. Psychite, waste of spell. Oh my god. I don't know what to do. But you know what I do know what to do? I know that I need to put a cut in here. So that's what I'm going to do at this point. Uh, folks, thanks for watching another episode. Yeah, we need the sacks over here. We'll take a look at that next time. Um, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.